According to scientific findings, the famous Iceman named Otzi was most likely characterized by dark skin, a bald scalp, and ancestry hailing from the Anatolian region. Through the use of cutting-edge sequencing technologies, a team of researchers has successfully scrutinized the genome of Otzi. As a result, a more precise understanding of the Iceman's heritage and physical features has been uncovered. Over a decade ago, the genome of Otzi was decoded for the first time, marking the first instance of sequencing a mummy's genome. This breakthrough provided valuable insights into the genetic composition of early Europeans. Advances in sequencing technology has allowed researchers from the Max Planck Institute for Evolutionary Anthropology and Eurac Research to more accurately recreate Otzi's genome. These recent findings provide further details about the Iceman's genetic makeup. Compared to other contemporaneous Europeans, Otzi's genome reveals a high proportion of genes shared with early farmers from Anatolia. Contrary to preceding discoveries, Otzi was balding and may have even been bald at the time of his death. Additionally, his skin was darker than previously assumed. Furthermore, Otzi's genes indicate a tendency towards diabetes and obesity. The current genetic composition of the majority of Europeans can be attributed to the fusion of three distinct ancestral groups. The first group consists of Western hunter-gatherers who merged with the second group of early farmers that migrated from Anatolia around 8,000 years ago. Subsequently, the third group of steppe herders from Eastern Europe joined the amalgamation about 4,900 years ago. At first glance, the genetic analysis of the Iceman's genome seemed to indicate the presence of genetic markers that were linked to the steppe herders. However, upon further scrutiny, these initial findings were found to be inaccurate. The reason for this inaccuracy was traced back to the initial sample, which had been contaminated with modern DNA. Advances in sequencing technologies have made it possible to decode many more genomes of prehistoric Europeans, often from skeletal remains. This has led to a re-examination of Otzi's genetic code in comparison to his contemporaries. The results reveal that among the numerous early European people who lived during the same period as Otzi, his genome shares a greater ancestry with early Anatolian farmers than any of his European counterparts. After analyzing the Iceman's genome, the research team has determined that he came from an isolated population with limited interaction with other European groups. Our team was taken aback by the complete absence of Eastern European steppe herders in the Iceman's genome. Additionally, his genetic makeup indicates that his ancestors migrated directly from Anatolia without any mixing with hunter-gatherer groups. The proportion of hunter-gatherer genes in Otzi's genome was also incredibly low, stated Johannes Krauser, who is the head of the Department of Archaeogenetics at the Max Planck Institute for Evolutionary Anthropology in Leipzig and a co-author of the study. The study on Otzi's appearance has yielded new discoveries. In the initial genome analysis, his skin type was determined to be Mediterranean European, but it was found to be even darker than what was previously believed. According to anthropologist Albert Zink, the co-author of the study and head of the Eurac Research Institute for Mummy Studies in Bolzano, this is the darkest skin tone ever recorded in contemporary European individuals. While it was once thought that the mummy's skin had darkened during its preservation in ice, it is now believed that Otzi's skin color was naturally dark. Understanding this fact is crucial for the proper conservation of the mummy. The prior depiction of Otzi is erroneous in regards to his hair. It is probable that as an adult, he did not possess a full head of thick hair, but rather only a small patch of hair. This is due to his genetic makeup, which indicates a genetic predisposition towards baldness. Professor Zink explains that this is a very clear finding and could be the reason why there is a lack of hair on the mummy. Otzi's genome also shows genes associated with an increased risk of type 2 diabetes and obesity, though his healthy lifestyle likely negated any negative effects from these factors. To support our channel's growth and ensure broader awareness, kindly hit the like and subscribe buttons. This will help us reach more individuals and disseminate valuable information. Thank you in advance.